If you're looking to have more fish in your diet, you'll love this recipe because I'm going to show you how to roast some fish that's full of flavour. So the first part of the recipe, I'm going to combine some tomatoes, olives and garlic in this pan. I'll give it a quick stir. And that's where I'm going to put my fish. But first of all, I'm going to make this delicious crumb mix. So I've got some sourdough breadcrumbs some parmesan cheese, some chopped parsley and some lemon zest. I'm going to give that a quick mix and that's going to become the topping for my fish. Now I really recommend for this recipe a good firmed flesh fish. A deep sea fish such as blue eye would be great. Now I'm going to add my fish to the pan. Now with the fish I'm just going to fold that belly flap down so that it roasts evenly and looks terrific too. I'm assembling my fish in this cast iron pot which is going to go straight into the oven. The recipe does call for four portions but I've just had two extra people arrive so I'm going to put six pieces of fish in here. I've got this beautiful Kalamata olive relish from the Artisan collection which I'm going to place over the top of the fish to really give them a good punchy flavour. Just about half a teaspoon. The olive relish has got an amazing flavour that will enhance the roasting of the fish really nicely. Okay, and now for the crumbs. So I've got my parmesan crumbs here, which I'll just put on each piece of fish, and then into the oven for 15 to 20 minutes. Okay, so I can see that my fish has baked off really nicely. It's nice and firm. The crumbs have become really golden and that Kalamata relish has melted through to create a beautiful sauce. So now for plating up. I'm going to serve this dish with some extra Kalamata relish to really bring this dish to life. 